Proverbs 29, 17, the scripture says, Discipline your children, you'll be glad that you did. Interestingly, several years ago, sociologists and child psychologists made an interesting discovery. Contemporary thought uh, had assumed that putting fences around playgrounds made children feel restricted in their recreation. And based on that theory, it was decided to remove the fences so that children wouldn't feel confined. To the astonishment of the experts, just the opposite effect occurred. Researchers found that children became more inhibited in their activities. They tended to huddle toward the middle of the playground, and they exhibited signs of insecurity. Interestingly, when the fences were replaced, the children once more played with great enthusiasm and freedom. What's the lesson here? Well, the lesson is we all need boundaries, something to define the limits of safety and security. Whereas the experts theorize that boundaries restrict creativity, children on the playground prove that we do need a clear understanding of what's safe and what's acceptable in order for ingenuity and inventiveness to flourish. So that means that your children will flourish and you'll function better as a parent when you clearly articulate guidelines. And the consequences for not following them are completely understood. There's a humorous story of a father who gave his 16-year-old son his first car. And before handing him the keys, he said, this is a magic car, son. Really? The boy replied. Yeah, answered his dad. One speeding ticket and it will disappear. And the first car you buy for your child should be a magic car too. The bottom line, God sets the rules for success in life and he rewards those who honor them. I'm Ray Jones, and that's another heart truth for your day.